Can you can you can you tell me the truth then? What is it? If I show you the place, will you promise not to like throw me in that water like he was? Cause he seemed pretty bad in that water. Uh come on, come all to the Blackwater Saloon where you can manage to get drinks. All the other good stuff. If you're thirsty or need to crave your alcoholic itch, feel free to come to the bar where you can manage to go and get something to drink. Hello? Just call for Gator. I hate my job. Thank you. Oh, hello, officer. <laughs> Bastard tried to my friend. Oh, sorry. Go ahead, miss. No, it's all right. Who here mm. speaks of bastards? Some guy. It's, it's Blackwater. It's about half bastards. <laughs> yeah, and are you in that half? Uh, it could be. Depends on the day, I suppose. Mm. There's some guy named Dennis that's always full bastard. I don't even know what half bastard is. And what the hell are you? I'm just a bartender. I only serve drinks. You also gossip. I, I just work here. I wonder that what you say about me when I get out of here. Or this woman or that man over there. I huh? suppose we're bastards too. What? I, I, I'm just working here. I don't... I, he just said about something about bastards in this town. That was only it. Give me a goddamn whiskey. Uh, oh, okay. As a matter of fact, give me three. One of each of these people. Okay. Wait, I thought you didn't like any of these people though. Why are you getting them muskies too? Cause I ain't a stingy bastard, that's why. <laughs> As a matter of fact, give me four. I want you to drink one too. We're gonna have a toast here. Oh, that's a lot of money. Don't patronize me. That's Wait, hold on. Dollars. We have to get some more in the back. I'll be back shortly. Hold on. Damn it, I thought the side door was open. Oh, this just leads out here. Um. Okay, the back door was definitely not. They, they locked the back door. <laughs> hey, you come back here. What? Wait, hold on. Hold on. What? Yeah. I'm getting the whiskeys in the back. I'm not running away from you. Listen here, don't you lie to me. I'm going to go there and wait. For every minute you make us wait, we're going to put a bullet in you. What? what? I don't want to die. Five minutes, five bullets. Okay, I'll be right back. I you swear. Promise? Yes. Listen, tell me your name. Uh, Gator. Uh, Gator Weaver, are you? Gator. Yes. Wait. That's my name. Wait, what? Gator, take a walk with me. Wait, hold on. Yo, why are you so aggressive? Come oh, on okay. Stop that. Oh. Take a walk with me. oh, okay. Listen, I cut the bullshit. You got a $500 gun on your back. Well, I use it for my bartending job, plus they're also waiting. Listen, who are you kidding? You weren't going to grab some alcohol, you were running away. No, I wasn't. I actually was going to go grab the alcohol. I need All the... right, then I'm going to go wait. Okay, then wait. I'll be back. I have to go to the bank. <laughs> Apparently, he had to... <gasps> See, that was almost because of you. Hey, that's my horse. Your horse almost killed me. Your horse is a murderer. Gator, okay. I gotta talk to you about something important. Okay, okay. after the drinks. I'll be waiting. Okay, I'll, I'll, be, right, I'll be right back. Uh, I'll, I'll be right back, hold on. I need to go to the bank because apparently you have to make the, the, the transaction and it has to be very hard because they, they yell at me if I don't put money there if I take... Uh, okay, I'll be right back. I should have just said I was going to go to the bank because he thought I was going to run anyways. This way I said, I got a four, $500 weapon? Huh? I'm gonna just get ten dollars. I don't. Okay, nice to see. Look. Oh. Ow. I guess he's gonna Sorry. wait a little longer here. Okay. The name's Renee. <laughs> Pleasure to meet you. Okay, so how many whiskeys are we getting for? One for everybody in here. Wait, but he has one as well. Count me out. Yeah, Why? he can count me out as well. Huh? I thought you, you wanted whiskeys. You guys are exceptionally rude. <laughs> you know what? Give us each two, Gator. Oh. 
Okay. Ah. Uh. These people. They don't want to drink. What the hell are they doing in the bar? <laughs> oh, you know, the charming conversation. <laughs> the charming conversation. Do you mind if I ask you a personal question? Uh, uh, what does that even mean? <laughs> yes or no? Uh, sure. You like warm hugs? I mean, they're kind of nice. They make me feel fuzzy inside, but I only got a warm hug from my mom, and that's it. That's the only person that hugs me, and she's gone. Well, you know I mean, makes... she's happy. You know what makes me warm and fuzzy on the inside? What? what? Whiskey, man. Give me some whiskey. Oh, okay, fine. I, I got it right here. <laughs> right. Okay, $2. Later. Okay, bye. Thanks for coming. Bye. Who the okay. hell was that? I have no idea. Okay, uh, two dollars. Uh, one for me and one for you, because they'll, they'll, they'll probably hurt me. <gasps> Five dollars! Okay. Now it's starting to say the least. Listen here. Uh huh? Yeah. The other day there was an officer found. <clears throat> left for uh -huh. dead. With a gunshot in his belly. And there was a man who rescued him. Yes, what about him? I believe I'm staring right into that man's eyes right now at this moment. False or true? Uh... Well, I mean, I did look at water and I thought it was a water god, but it was a person that was there because I was fishing. <laughs> true or false? Uh... Uh... True? Listen, Gator, where was this place? Where did that take place? Um... It was somewhere deep in Lagraw. Usually there's like a farm and other stuff. In Lagra. Yes. Now where the hell is Lagra? You don't know where Lagra's at. <laughs> Can you show me? Can you teach me? Um maybe. <laughs> can you can you can you tell me the truth then? What is it? If I show you the place, will you promise not to like throw me in that water like he was? Cause he seemed pretty bad in that water, and I just found him, and he was like, breathe. He's like, you know. Listen, man, I ain't no. It sounded snake. very scary. I'm from the mountain. If I were to stab you, I wouldn't do it from the back with trickery. I'd do it from the front after telling you I was gonna do it. I'm trying to help somebody. Hey, who are you trying to help? Someone dear to me. Who is? We thought about honesty, okay? We thought about honesty. Renee. <laughs> Dude, I'm not. <laughs> what do you want me to tell you? What are you afraid of? I'm no barbarian. I'm no savage. I they tell me. We they tell me. Tell you what? Who you're modest about? You said that we took a dose about modesty and honesty, modesty, whatever. Honesty. Oh, I don't know what that even means. That means telling the truth. D did you do the same thing too? Who are you helping? Listen, the person I'm helping, it's complicated. Let's say somebody died, okay? And that okay. somebody was dear to me. He was my brother. I loved him. He was an Irishman. He had a he had a wife and kids. Now listen. Someone's gonna erect a tomb for me, for this man. And the person that's gonna do that for me, I wanna do him a favor. This person was hurt. Mm. And that event of that day is gonna solve a riddle. I just need to know where it's at. Okay. Listen, solve what are you, an investigator? You need to know all the facts. Just show no. me the place. Because everyone's been acting all weird ever since I brought in that guy. I don't even know who he is. He just said he was a deputy. And I just found the body. I just found it across. That's all. I don't want to do anything else. I don't want to get hurt. That's what Gator. I'm saying, being honest. Gator, show me this place. I'm not going to hurt you. You promise? If I said it, then I mean it. <laughs> okay, fine. But if you go and manage to do that, I'm haunting you for the rest of my life and my spirit. Come on, let's go. <laughs> also, uh, Otaku, thank you Gator, so much for the follow. Still alive? Uh. Well, I mean, in Legras, it's kind of complicated. A lot of stuff really happens, and, you know, our our, our cousins went to war and over land and, and things like that, so she kind of got very stressed because, you know, they were like her nephews and, and everything, and yeah. Listen here. 
Okay. Gator. Yes? That gun on your back, is it there for style points or you actually know how to use it? I know how to use it. <laughs> We're out in the wild together now. If something happens, we have to have each other's back. Okay. I got a lot of enemies out there. Wait, you have a lot of enemies? If they come after me, are you gonna defend me? Or are you gonna cower and whimper away? Well, what if they're like, we only want to deal with you, not him? Also, we have to take a right. Well, then you say, it's one for all and all for one. Oh, uh, what? To him over my dead body. Oh, and then I think at that point, I think we'd both be dead. No, then you, sh then you cause a diversion and I'll get away. Huh? Gator, that's going to Oh. I was just I was just trying to break the ice. Oh. <laughs> Listen, when someone comes after you, I'm ready to fucking shoot them for you. We're riding together. Well, I mean, I, I, at that point we probably need like a better understanding of like why would they be hunting this person and we just want to be on our way. We don't want any problems with them, you know. And then we proceed to ride off or something like that, right? Listen, I don't think you understand. The people <laughs> that are after me are bad people. Like who? Listen, are you affiliated with anyone, Gator? No. You know a fella named Reese? No. You don't? I don't know who that is. No. How about Elizabeth? Um, I don't know. There's like some fancy ladies around here, but I don't know any Elizabeth. Why, is she like... You, you know, your love or your or your wife or something? Absolutely not. I'm not married. Oh. These are my enemies. Just because someone got a fancy name doesn't mean that they're nice people. Well, I mean, they sound pretty fancy. I mean, that's kind of nice on its own. But then I kind of wouldn't trust them. Good. Because they smell funny. <laughs> Listen, how far is this ride? It's pretty far. I suppose you could always point it out on the map, but this way is better. All right. I mean, at the same time, we can go through the the long journey that's ahead of us of not getting eaten by wolves. Are you going to have my back when the wolves attack? Or are you going to have to try to figure out with them too and have a nice conversation? No, I mean, usually when it comes to the wolves, I have to shoot them. But listen, it's always that way. Well, what about the wolves that walk on two feet and are caught people? Well, I mean, I mean, it would be hard because I don't know those people. But if they're trying to hurt me, I would probably at least like, you know, like shoot near them and then run. Don't worry, I'll point them out to you. Oh, OK, OK. I, I trust you more than enough. Gator, tell me more about this day when you found this man. Were there any clues? Um, I was just minding my own business and then all of a sudden, all of a sudden, I just started hearing this person, gar like, gargling. And then I thought, like, I thought it was a sign, like, from the spirits or something from the Legra God, you know? And everything of the Swamp Gods, please, please bless us so that we don't die, amen, you know? What the <laughs> hell? Are you a religious person? Well, I mean, in Legra, yeah, but, I mean, we have, like, a Swamp God, which is, like, a weird thing that has, like, tentacles and whatnot. Uh... That's where you're from. You're from the swamp. Yes. <laughs> Listen, they ever cage you up in that prison cell back there? Yes, many times. I don't like being in there. I don't like it either. It always smells awful. Listen, so why are you helping me right now try to unravel who hurt this deputy? Uh, all I know is that, like, basically he was shot. We're trying to find who did it. Huh. Okay, so, um, this little house that was here, I usually say hi to the person that's there, but they're not really here right now. Um, so beyond this lovely shed thing over there, and then you just kind of go at the edge. Oh god, I'm scared here. This is where you found them? Yeah, follow me. Are you sure no one's home? No. Hold on a second. I'm gonna double check. Ah. Open up! 
I think the door should be open. You can just kick down the door. Listen, the fire's on it is some bacon. Seems like someone was here recently. The pot's oh. still cooking. Maybe they probably went out through the back. I think we just missed them. God damn it. I could have probably talked to them too, but at least the bacon smells good. Mm. Okay, Cookie, don't kick me, please. Thank you. <gasps> All right, so uh, here it was, just minding my business, going through this way. And then right over here. Right where that bush was at, right beyond the bush is where they found his body. It was right by that river. Who's well, that they? goes this way. I thought you found it. Well, I did find it, but then, of course, I think the deputies and what, them wanted me to show where it was at, so I showed them. Ah, uh, so they already know where it is. Yeah. God damn it. <laughs> uh, wait, was I supposed to say that earlier? I thought we were the first ones here to look. This is very deep in LaGraw, so, like, I don't know why they would want to throw it here other than to maybe hide it, because the gators can always come by and kind of have, like, a nice meal or something, but that's what I think. Seems like a great way to dispose of the body. So do you know anyone who would probably hide the body really well? Maybe someone that would be, like, really, like, sneaky? I don't know. You know the law. They piss off a lot of goddamn people. Mm. But it takes a real barbarian to do what they did. Shoot a man in the gut and leave him to be eaten by gators. Yeah. It's not fun. It's not fun. I've almost what gotten eaten by gator once when I was born. What the hell does that mean? I was born on top of a gator. Bullshit. I, no, I like... We have this tradition in LeGraw. You basically hit the, ga the gator with like a piece of wood and knock it out. And then, of course, my mom gave birth on top of the gator and then... Apparently, I was supposed to have a brother, but the gator woke up in time and ate my brother. His name was Javier. What the hell is wrong with your mother? <laughs> it's part of tradition! Tradition Let's... my ass! You know, us LeGraw people are very crazy. Uh, we always have, like, you know, roadkill raccoon as well. It's so tasty. <laughs> Where are you from? I'm from the mountain. Uh, doesn't the mountain have, like, weird people, too? Like, the Skinner brothers? I don't know those people. I've never well, heard of them. Really? Hmm. Are we going the right way? Uh, wait, which way are we going? <laughs> back, back west. Oh, back, back, okay. Um, okay, we gotta go this way, left. I follow you. All right, ride, Cookie, ride! Listen, it's unfair, because you have one of my secrets. Now I need one of yours. Um... That f that way, if you spill the beans on mine, I spill the beans on yours. Uh, uh, okay. Um, I accidentally shot and killed someone in Valentine a long time ago. And, of course, Sheriff Maddox never knew it was me. Who was it that you shot and killed? Yeah, I don't know. Some guy. Was it a local? Yeah. We had a lot of problems, and he kept looking at me funny, but that was it. I still feel my hands trembling from that moment of time. <sighs> okay, seems like it's getting light out. We should be good. Wait, what'd you say this man's name was? Sorry, I wasn't paying attention. Um, this is very much like a long time ago. Man, hey, no secret. Tell me a fucking secret. It is! They never found out who it was! Yeah, but you know who it was. Yeah, which was me. No, but who did you shoot? Oh, uh, just some local. Ah. Man, that, that ain't no secret. Well, I mean, I kind of stabbed him. And then they kind of ran in, and then they were like, What the hell was that? And then I left, so... It still... Still kind of, like, killed someone. I, I mean, that's the only secret I could provide. Listen, I asked you earlier if you were a murderer, and you told me no. You lied to me. <laughs> All I did was be honest with you. 
I wanted to be your friend. I bought you a drink and you lied to me. Well, at least I showed you where it was to, to I, go. I, I know that's the true place now. That is the true place. That's where I found him. Wait, who the hell is that? Who? That over there. Look. Left, right, where? It was at the right. Wait, who, who the hell is this? Oh, it's some local. Okay, we're fine. It's some local. Oh my god. But yeah, you, you said a secret. Maybe Where did you say stopped. if I was a murderer or anything? You didn't even say that to me. Yeah, Honestly, I don't I remember. I said, are you a murderer? You looked at me and you said, no. I help the children. That's what you said. What? I help the children? I just serve drinks at the bar. How does it make any sense? God, you're so selfish. All right, fuck the children then. I guess you don't care about them. I mean, the children are nice. I you care about care the children. About your, you don't even care about your baby brother. They ate him by an alligator. And you're so well, that wasn't you. my fault. You can't wait to share the fucking story. Well, I mean, people always ask, so I always tell them. <laughs> Fuck your brother. <gasps> I kidding. thought you were my no, friend. No, 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 that was mean. I didn't mean that. I'm sorry. <laughs> your brother's amazing. Yeah, in spirit. He's amazing. He's probably here. Because you know your mother fed him to an alligator. No, the alligator woke up in time. And then all of a sudden just ate my brother. And then they just said, we can't do anything about it, sorry. And then she cried. And then she told me when I was little. She didn't feed him. That's cruel. That's so cruel.